Welcome to the wildest battle in the insect world. Today, two massive colonies face off in a fight for survival. In one corner, the master builders, the mighty termites defending their fortress of mud and wood. In the other, a relentless legion, the unstoppable army ants, marching as a living river across the forest floor. The ants are hungry, aggressive, and looking for a new home. The termites have everything to lose. This is more than a fight, it's a clash of strategy, strength, and survival. The termites must protect their queen and young. The ants need food and territory. Only one colony will stand when the sun sets. Millions of tiny feet shake the ground. The air crackles with tension. Our cameras are ready to capture every attack and defense. Will the termites' fortress hold, or will the ants' numbers overwhelm them? This is nature's drama at its most raw. Get ready for an epic showdown between warrior termites and army ants. The battle is about to begin. Let's dive in. Meet the defenders, warrior termites, living in a fortress built from mud, saliva, and wood. Inside, millions work together under the rule of a single queen, who lays thousands of eggs daily. The colony is organized, workers build and care for the young, while soldiers defend. Termite soldiers are bigger with massive jaws that can snap an ant in half. Their greatest strength is defense. Thick walls, maze-like tunnels, and perfect knowledge of their home. Soldiers block tunnels with their bodies, setting ambushes and plugging holes. Some can even shoot sticky, toxic goo to trap invaders. Their strategy stay inside, force the enemy into narrow tunnels, and fight where their jaws are most effective. But they have weaknesses. Most are blind, relying on chemical signals, and there are fewer soldiers than workers. If the walls break in too many places, they risk being overwhelmed. Their survival depends on holding the fortress and fighting in tight spaces. The termites are ready. The question is, will it be enough? The invaders are closing in, the tension is rising, the stage is set for war. Now meet the invaders' army ants, a superorganism on the move. They have no permanent home building temporary nests from their own bodies as they travel. Every ant is both worker and soldier forming a relentless coordinated army. Their strength is in numbers, millions attack at once swarming and overwhelming their prey. With powerful jaws and venomous stings, they are a moving carpet of destruction. Scouts find weak spots in the termite mound, then signal the army with chemical trails. The ants chew through mud walls opening paths for the swarm. Their tactics brute force speed and overwhelming numbers. But they have vulnerabilities they must feed constantly, and if the battle drags on, they risk starvation. Exposed in the open, they have no fortress to retreat to, their only defense is attack, they must win quickly or lose everything, today they're risking it all for the ultimate prize. The termite colony. The invasion begins, the clock is ticking, the battle lines are drawn. The first wave of army ants hits the termite mound like a black tide, termite soldiers rush out, jaws snapping, meeting the ants head on, the clashes are brutal. Ants fall but more swarm forward, climbing over their dead. The ants find a weak spot where rain has softened the wall and focus their attack. Termite workers scramble to repair breaches but the ants break through. Soon, streams of ants pour into the dark tunnels. Inside, termite soldiers block passages, turning tunnels into deadly choke points. Here, the ants lose their advantage in numbers, forced to fight one by one. The soldiers hold the line, crushing invaders and protecting the colony's heart. But the ants are cunning. Smaller groups slip through unguarded entrances, heading for the nursery. The queen and young are in danger. If the ants reach the nursery, the colony is doomed. The suspense is unbearable. The fate of the mound hangs in the balance. The final confrontation is near. Deep inside the mound, the ants reach the nursery's outer chambers. Desperate termite workers join the fight, buying time for their queen. Just as the ants break into the royal chamber, they're met by the queen's elite guards. Suddenly, a sweet smell fills the air. The termites unleash their secret weapon. Special chambers release a fungus cultivated by the termites. Harmless to termites, the spores are deadly to ants, clogging antennae, blinding them and paralyzing their bodies. The ants lose coordination, stumbling in confusion. The termite soldiers strike, eliminating the disoriented invaders. Outside, the ant army falters, cut off from their scouts. The termites push the ants back, out of the tunnels. The defeated ants retreat, leaving their dead behind. Against all odds, the termites have won. Defense, strategy, and their secret weapon saved the colony. What an incredible victory. Thanks for joining us for this epic showdown.
Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more wild battles from nature's hidden world.